So I was between doing this video and not doing this video. So I think I'm gonna do this video. I bought a wash and a dryer second hand. It's supposed to be in very, very good condition. Um, they a very good, good brand. And I went to go hook it up. I realized that it had four prongs and I need three in order to put the, like plug the dryer in. So I go to Target. They don't have an adapter to go from a four prong to a three prong. Then I go to Liz because I was required to go to Liz. And they was like, oh, we don't have any of the converters. So it would be a week wait. It's probably easier for you to just get the cord that has a three prong and you could just change the entire cord. So I was like, okay, cool. I could definitely do that. Um, I've never done this before, but I decided I'm going to have a go at it. I'm going to try to record myself doing it, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. So let's see how this goes. This is the cord. Three prongs. And then this is the cord that's already in there and it has four. So I'm going to take this cord off and replace it with this one. Never done this before, but I'm about to wing it. I definitely probably was not supposed to like pry this out, but I did. Um, because it was no way of getting this bolt off. It's just super, super tight. So there's the three. I am supposed to attach these three to those three. I really just don't know which to attach where, but I guess I'm gonna figure it out. You guys, I'm on the floor, as you can see. My fan is. There we go. My fan is currently dying, <laughs> but I had it on a charger, and that bolt that I couldn't get out, oh, I bent the, I bent the casing that was on it, and it helped me to get it off. <laughs> So I have it all. I ended up calling my friend back home, he's an electrician, and I was just like, can you help me? And he was like, I'm on my way to football training. So I was like, oh my gosh. So he was like, what happened? So I explained, and I was like, these are three, but in like attached to the dryer, there's four. I don't think I can turn this around. So being that it's four, wires already connected to the dryer I'm like where is this fourth wire because it is nowhere to be found on this you see four because I see three so he explained to me that these are pretty much like neutral I'm not an electrician so don't cut me on any of this and it's colored wires on has a black a white and a red and a teal so you said the teal one is the ground one but I don't have a fourth one Anyway, so then I was like, let me YouTube this. And apparently a lot of people have issues or look at it crazy because there's four wires and there's only three on the replacement cord. So yeah, here we go. We're back at it. This one's hard. Hold on. Okay, I had to change the size. There we go. Cool. So, those are the three. So, I'm just gonna take this off, take this off, and take this off. And then I have to unscrew that. I really don't know how this is gonna come off. But I'm gonna figure it out as best I can. Okay, it's off. Woo, woo, woo. And now I have the three in place. I just need to screw these in. I'm probably not going to record this part because trying to hold the fan. Oh, I got it in. But I have to change the head in the screwdriver. Where have I put it? There we go. Yeah. See, I changed it to a flat hair because I had to get that bolt out. So let me, let me change it over. Back, back. 
Shout out to Walmart for the um. <laughs> Shout out to Walmart for my little tool kit. It's coming in a clutch. Got all my all my bits. Look at me. I think I should just be a mechanic or something. I don't know. All right. Oh, let me let me go do this and come back. They are on. It's so excited. I'm sorry that there's no lighting back here, you guys. But yeah, the one and now I'm just about to put these to stabilize this piece because I have to put the casing back on. I don't know if it's called a casing or not, but I have to put that back on. So yeah. I'll be back. That's my lock. I am trying to screw the top piece. I'm trying to screw the top piece in, right? So that these two come together. And I can't put the screwdriver in the hole. So tell me why it's like, I don't know if you can see it, but do you see that? It's like metal in there. Oh my gosh. I cannot with this all back to normal with three prongs i'm so excited now let's see if it actually works Oy. all right now to clean up pack up i'm gonna attach the hose put it to the whatever that's called and yeah damn see if it kicks over I did not think that was going to take me as long as it did to finish with the dryer. I had to cut the hose. So this hose was pretty long. I cut it and it's a shorter one back there. I'm not going to get back there and show you. But here we go. They're in place. Yay. And let's see. Ooh. drying I honestly hope I attach the hose back there properly I may have to adjust that because all right that's enough anyway guys hope you enjoyed it stay tuned for more videos I have a little bit more time now I didn't have much time over summer to keep doing more videos but I definitely I'm trying to make time to do certain things. Send any video suggestions that you may have. So just stay tuned.